after freshly washing your face, spray with your favorite toner. Use some moisturizer and be sure not to be too hard on your skin when you're rubbing it in because this causes wrinkles. Highlight all the areas you want to pop. My favorite part is the collarbones. It looks gorgeous. I'm so excited about these new Lash Bunny brushes. They have just about every type of brush you need in the kit. I highly recommend it. I love foundation sticks and I love Bobbi Brown, so I'm really excited about these two new products. The only thing I wish I didn't do is this. I wish I used a brush to apply it on because it is very potent and very thick. As you can clearly see, a little goes a long way in this product, so I'm going to be blending for the next little bit here. with a wet concealer under my eye before I put the powder on so this one's just gonna brighten up just a little bit and contour the lighter parts of my face. rare that I'll wear cream blush but I find these Lash Bunny brushes it's very easy to apply you just kind of plop it on like that <laughs> So I know the 
this baking under eye technique is kind of old school in the world of makeup, but honestly it never fails. I love it. I love how it catches the eyeshadow when you're trying to do it and it, how the way it brightens your eyes. I hate doing liquid liner probably more than anything in the world, but I find the stiller you are, the better if you kind of just don't. The eye skin is very sensitive and it, it wiggles a lot, so if you stay still, it's going to be easier for you. By the way, I didn't realize till about the end of the video when I took a break that my jawline and my temple wasn't blended in very good. So just make sure you don't put that Bobbi Brown stick directly on your face unless you're being very gentle or it's the lighter foundation one. You don't actually really need mascara for with the lashes I'm about to use, but I'm just, I don't know, I'm just OCD in the sense that I always have to put mascara on. <laughs> so this will be my fourth time wearing these lashes and they still look absolutely fabulous. Just like the liquid eyeliner, you really don't want to wiggle your eyes. The calmer you are during this, the better it's going to turn out. This product is good to just sort of fluff up your brows and keep them in place all night. I'll be honest, I don't actually love the retractable lip liners by NYX or any other brand for that matter. I find you don't really get to sharpen it and the, it's just too thick to do your lips, but it's a nice color, so hey. <laughs> I'm seriously obsessed with this lingerie NYX line. All the lipsticks remind me of the Kylie lipsticks. They are so good and so long wear and the colors are so cute. This Ben Nye palette is worth every penny. It's got just about every shade of bronzer you're gonna want. 